superb uh, innings so far and absolute champion of the game. You know, three premierships with the Hawks there. Uh, just your ability to be able to, you know, cause damage with each possession. And not many players over the years that I've played in my time have I seen to um, have that ability. So you're definitely one of a kind, brother. You should be extremely proud of yourself and you have an extremely high um, place in this wonderful game of AFL. Uh, your short time here at Port Adelaide and also, you know, your time at the Mighty Hawks. And you'll go down as well, they're great. It's an amazing achievement. I've looked up to you, Brandon. Um, you're a super player. But congratulations, brother. Um, I love watching you play. What you've achieved over your career from a, uh, a midfielder who dominated at Port uh, and then coming to Hawthorne and help us win three premierships in a row. He's sharing this milestone with both the Hawthorne and, and Port Adelaide footy clubs. He's, he's served both clubs with, with great dignity and he's going to go down as one, one of the game's greats. So fittingly it's Sean Burgoyne who wins the toss for the Hawks, points to your right of screen and he'll go down and address his players before what is a massive match. Mitchell to Burgoyne, game 350, 350 games in VFL, AFL history, he's the oldest player in the competition as it stands at the moment and the great Sean Burgoyne really misses. Yeah. Here is Burgoyne. Look yeah. at this. Look at this. And listen to this. That was great ruck work as well. The boys are getting over to Johnny Segler. Siren sounds. Sean Burgoyne can celebrate what has been an incredible career. It was an unbelievable week. Um, my kids loved it. My wife over there. She's loved it. I've got messages from all over Australia, a couple from international and a little bit awkward as well because, you know, the focus is on me <laughs> and uh, I'm, not, I'm not used to that. But, yeah, definitely felt the love from, from everyone this week. He's such a legend, legend of the club and it's just crazy how he just keeps on turning up and he's so old but he's just so good. I think I've said that a couple of times but, I mean, to get the win for him, it's, it's, it's what we needed to do. Not only for, sort of for the team and for our season but also um, for Shawnee bloody legend so glad we could uh, get that for him for the milestone. It's gone so fast it feels like only yesterday he was sort of playing his, his first few AFL games and here we are at 350 so just so proud of him and, and what he's been able to achieve.